What's up, fiends? Alucard here. Today I have another Dollar Tree haul for you uh, from the end of July 2022. All right, so I only got a few this time. Um, I got seven. So let's see what we've got. I only got one Blu-ray, and I'll show that one off first. Uh, it is not. It is not horror, by the way. <laughs> Uh, but it is Crazy Rich Asians. Uh, this movie is pretty funny. Um, I did see it a while back when it came out. Uh, and I did enjoy it. And so I saw it was a buck. So I was like, heck yeah. Um, it's a good little movie, actually. If you if you like like romantic comedy type of deals, it's a, it's a pretty good one. It's pretty funny. So now let's get to the good stuff, right? First up, we got The Mermaid's Curse. This has... Rebecca Finch, Tom Hendrick, and Tony Manders. Yes, I've not heard of any of those people. Um, it, is, uh, it is from ITN Distribution. After the discovery of an illicit affair, a journalist falls in love with a seductive, sultry, and young mermaid he meets on a beach. Infatuation turns into obsession as he gets drawn in by her powers. The more he falls for her, the more he will learn of the dangers of falling in love with a siren. So, yeah, this is probably terrible, I'm sure. Uh, but, hey, I couldn't pass it up. All right. Speaking of terrible, I'm sure this one's terrible, too. It's called Alien Invasion. Yeah, look at that cover. <laughs> it looks like looks like freaking uh, Lord Voldemort or something. Uh, let's see. This one is from Vertical Entertainment. It's after receiving a package containing a mysterious documentary. Sarah Hamilton, a young journalist and UFO investigator, takes a trip to one of the biggest UFO cover-up sites in history. And it's there she meets Joe, the park ranger, whose job is to guide her around the forest while protecting her from all the dangerous predators in the forest. The unexpected interruption by one of the strange beings that live in the forest forces them to change their plans, leading to a macabre game of cat and mouse that will take them deep into hell itself. All right, next up, I have one with a slipcover. It's called Fabricated City. This is the, it, is, it is DVD. Uh, let's see. It's by TPS and CJ Entertainment. Uh, in real life, Quan Yu is unemployed, but in the virtual world, he's recognized as a top gamer with no rival. While playing as usual at a local internet cafe, Quan Yu is stunned to learn he had become the prime suspect of a shocking crime, the rape and murder of a high school girl. The police arrest him, and he learns that he has been framed by a large corporation for the crime. With the help of fellow gamer Demolition and hacker Yao Wu, he sets out to uncover the truth and clear his name. All right, yeah, so it is, um, I believe it is South Korean, if I'm not mistaken. Uh... So yeah, this, this might be. It sounds kind of like um, that gamer movie, but I'm, it's probably better because that gamer movie kind of sucked. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll check it out. All right, I did get I did get one more slipcover of Yummy, the Shutter original, and let's see, it's by RLJ Entertainment and Raven Banner also. Uh, while waiting for his girlfriend to come out of surgery, Michael stumbles upon a terrified young woman gagged and strapped to an operating table. She is, she is the result of an experimental rejuvenation treatment. Offering to help her escape, he removes her restraints but soon realizes he's just unleashed a virus that will turn the entire hospital into bloodthirsty zombies. All right, so it's a zombie flip. All right, cool. I didn't know that. <laughs> so, it sounds okay. Um, I do for the most part like the Shutter originals. Um, most of them are pretty decent. So, so I got two more. Um, these are kind of the bigger ones. Uh, so we got Glass on DVD. Yep, this was the this is the third of the trilogy. Um, I didn't hate it like a lot of people did. Um, although it is the weakest e easily. Um, but you know I have the other two, so now I have the I have the complete set all on DVD. By the way. <laughs> So, yeah, M. Night Shyamalan, uh, you know, Sam Jackson, Bruce Willis, James McAvoy, uh, Anya Taylor-Joy. Yep. Yeah. Uh, you know, it, it, it completes the story, I guess you could say. So, yeah, it, it's pretty good. I, I enjoyed it. 
It was a little long, though. All right, and the the big one that I got, at least in my eyes, um, I actually got season two of In the Flesh. This show is incredible. I cannot say enough good things about it. And I saw this for a dollar, so or a dollar twenty-five. So I was like, uh, "Yes, please." So now I need to get the first season. I've seen them. I've seen both seasons. This is, there's only two seasons, um, but uh, yeah. So this is is a really incredible story about this guy who becomes a zombie, and in in this world, they kind of have the zombies living with regular people. And it's uh yeah, it's really it's a really, really interesting story. It's a BBC uh show and uh highly, highly recommend it. It is available on Tubi if you do want to watch the whole thing. It's only nine episodes long total between the two seasons. So yeah, it's not a real big commitment. Um, but super, super awesome show, and I was stoked to find this one there. So yeah, good stuff. All right, so that is my haul for this week. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up. It really helps me out. And subscribe if you're new. Other than that, guys, I'll see you all later. Remember to stay spooky. Peace.